Hey guys, Jerry G. And we're on the road today with Jenny T. Yeah, she's back there. Today I am on the Walkie H9 all-wheel drive. The, the beast of a bike. And Jen is on the She's in her, oh, had a look, Ocelot Pro. Yeah, she's in the mid cycle Ocelot Pro. So, hey. Uh-oh, we got a, a uni here. So, yeah, today we are out and about. We couldn't pass it up. The weather is gorgeous for <laughs> mid-September, huh? So, this is t-shirt weather for sure. So, it's can't, can't pass it up. So, yeah, we're heading downtown to the Pickle Festival. Yeah. Pickle Festival. Uh-oh, looks like we got a crew up here. Of the unis. You're okay. You're okay. <laughs> hey guys, Mick, where's Mick? Who? Mick? Mick? There a Mick? Is there a Mick here? No? No Mick? Hey guys. Rock on, all right. Nice. Nice. Cool, what is that? I gotta ask, what's that? Uh, uh, Solaria XXX. Solar oh yeah, I've heard of that. Heard of, yeah. uh, that's nice. How big's that battery? 60 volt. 60 volt, how many amps? I think like 35. 35, yeah, that yeah. sounds about right. 60 volts. Huh? How big's that motor? Uh, I don't know. I think they got like 3,000 watt motors uh, on them this things. One, this one's, one's, this one's, this one's eight. Making motors every six months for them though. Yeah. This, they got a big one just coming out here. Yeah? This one's 8 kilowatts. So wow. 8, or That's nice. Yeah. That's sharp. How long have you had it? Since February. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Would you buy it again? Oh, yeah, dude. Because this one was shipped to your door 3500 and any other one's five grand. So. You having trouble on the pass? Anybody giving you a hard time? No, man. No. As long as you put your wheels down when you see the cops. That's a great, yeah. it's a great bike. Yeah, thanks, man. I appreciate it. I'm Mike, dude. I'm Jerry. Jerry? Yeah, I got a YouTube channel, Jerry T on e-bikes. Jerry T on e-bikes? Yeah, so I, re I do a lot of recordings, so. Oh, yeah, man. Nice, man. Yeah, Where are you guys off to today? I think we're headed towards Cliff's, Cliff's Bike Park right now. Oh, nice. Yeah. That's the way to go. Oh, yeah. You guys are more than welcome to follow along, you know? Yeah. <laughs> hey, have fun, man. Pleasure up. meeting you. Yep, you too, Jerry. Here we go. I love running into the guys. I was looking for a friend of mine that hangs with the uni crowd. I always get invited. <laughs> I never seem to think I'm gonna fit in with that, with those kind of bikes. And you know, they're always very kind and nice and I love hanging out and talking to them. So, but I don't feel like, uh, an old man is gonna fit in with that, that crowd. I don't know if I'd fit in on one of those one of those uh, bikes. You know those uh, Super 73s, those Surron style bikes. I don't know if that's my my cup of tea. So we got the, the rowers out there. If you can see that, trying to turn the camera. A beautiful day for them, absolutely. 
got the fishermen out there. Uh, I got to laugh because I used to have a factory down here and uh, 25 years ago and um, um, yeah right across the river over there that that green bridge there used to be active we could, could cross that but yeah my warehouse is right in that building over in there which I think they're tearing down um, and they're actually taking out that bridge so but yeah back when I had a warehouse down here uh, you didn't see any of this you really didn't um, people weren't uh, too comfortable with coming downtown so now everything's changed it's great down here they do a wonderful job of keeping up with uh, maintenance and taking care of the place. <laughs> so, but yeah, we're heading down to, I think I'm not sure if I got cut off, but yeah, the Pickle Festival. <laughs> so, we got something going on every day. Today is Saturday. They got this pickle festival I've been hearing about. So, why not, right? It's going to be downtown in Mall C. So, that's right up on our route of our typical downtown run. So, why not? Yeah. Let's go check it out. Free dog. So, yeah, you just, you didn't see guy, people bringing dogs down and all that kind of stuff. So, you got condos going up, so it really, and that's what changed everything. Before, it used to be just nothing but bars. So, you, you get the young crowd down here and everybody get all liquored up and Somebody would start a fight, somebody probably pull a gun. It just gets bad. So so they wised up a little bit and they instead of putting all these bars. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Somebody's watching the uh, the road the races. So but yeah they Instead of putting bars up, uh, liquor bars all over the place, they're building condos. So once people start living down here, they start taking a little bit better care of things. Yeah. So, yeah, this is our typical route we'll go through. We'd like to see what kind of trouble we can get into down here. Yeah, the river is nice and you get so much activity down here. It's, uh, but yeah, you see the condos up here. Those have been here, but they really start turning these warehouses into condos down here. So you get a real big uh, white collar crowd that lives down here. And uh, so, you know, everyone's taking care of things. So you still have your, your bars and your eateries that have opened up, but that's not the same kind of situation. It's not the uh, same kind of uh, uh, situation. It's more of a laid back sort of uh, relationship. But yeah, all these all these buildings here, yeah, they're now roots and condos. So you got the river, the waterfront, your downtown. Um, so, you know, the one thing I don't see is a lot of grocery shopping. So I'm not sure how 
and I would imagine that's addressed probably in these condos because you got just everything down here. So, but it's nice. Uh, this whole area in downtown has really changed. It's really for the better. So, got hotels here, the eateries. bike always seems to end up at Margaritaville somehow. <laughs> Every bike I get seems to be on autopilot and ends up down here. So, but yeah. More condos. So yeah, I, we've never even been in any of these bars. So except Margaritaville, we've been in. Okay, make sure you don't run Jen over. Okay. Yeah, you see the boats and the tiki bars. Uh, <laughs> the bridge is down, so all the boats got to wait trains must be coming through so yeah so yeah we come down here and we'll just stop we're gonna actually plan to have lunch come down here it sounds silly with all these eateries <laughs> all these bars here Well, these boats will dock off and then go to the restaurants. And then you have the, again, more condos up in the, up there. Wow. Yeah, we used to have a 30 foot cruiser. Right behind you. Look at you. That's nice. Thank you. How you like it? Real nice. It's sharp. Electric's good company too. Yeah. That's a nice bike. Would you buy the bike again? Yeah. Good. It's good. That's great. It gets you out, doesn't it? Yeah. I know. We love it. So, hey, enjoy your day. Thank you. You too. Hey, who's that guy? <laughs> hey, people even bringing their dogs down here. climb out of the valley so the river runs low and runs through and everything else is a valley so um, we're gonna climb up out of here head into downtown this is one nasty hill here just nasty I don't think anything I don't think video does its justice, but this baby is, I almost used it for my hill climb challenge, but that means I gotta come downtown every time to do the hill climb, which I've got another, another hill that pulls me out of the valley. 
So I'll let these guys go. Yep. Hey, where's that pickle festival at? It's that way. That way, I knew it. <laughs> All right, thanks. <laughs> thanks. All right. Good people to help guide us, so. Ah, where the free, where the free stamp is. I. This is why e-biking is so much fun, guys. You got there. I think we found the pickle festival. Ay yeah, yeah. Can. Oh, it's uh, uh, you gotta have tickets. Oh man, I want a pickle, man. Let's ride around. I know, man. What happened? Is it September or what? Trying to figure out how to get the bike in. Get it in there? Yeah. <laughs> we rode ours right in. It's it, up there, though. Oh, did you? You got to pay to get in. I know. Yeah. Yeah, we just rode ours right in. This one. I mean, I saw other scooters and stuff in there. Nice. How do you like it? I like I mean, it's great for little things like the ball fields. That's where we were this morning. Right. We got a couple of those uh, from uh, Hardcore Cycles. Okay. And we love it. Same size tires you got. Right. Ours is more like mountain and. Right. It's got dual. Yeah, you got a motor on the front of yours yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah. Freaking. You get that motor in. <laughs> I know. You need it to get through some of these trails and that. So. Yeah. But. We took them down to Florida and rode some of the trails down there. We have blast. Yeah, they're fun. But we haven't done too many trails in Ohio yet. Really. Well, the summer come on. We just got them last winter. Now's the best time. Yeah. You got the turning of the leaves and stuff. Out back in the woods and stuff. Where, where do you guys live? Moringo, down pretty close to Columbus. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're just about 30 minutes north of Columbus. Look up the Emerald Necklace when you come up here. Emerald Necklace? Yeah, that's a trail. It's 87 miles. All just around. trail. It's not roads, it's trail, and it goes all around the city of Cleveland. Is it like gravel or blacktop? It's paved. Oh, it's paved? It's paved. Oh, wow. and it is pristine, man. We'll have to try that. So you can do it in chunks if you want, so, is but yeah. Is there a place to charge them? Because, like, ours only gets about 70 miles on charge. Uh, the only place that I can think of is um, at uh, the uh, marina. There's a marina, Amarnacolis Mer boat launch uh -huh. in Rocky River. And you can plug in a charge there. There are a few pavilions, but 
We might get a little bit more. You know, the more you paddle, the, the longer they last. I know. I know. She gets ten times the battery I get. So yeah, I don't. That's I'm the same right. with her. Yeah. She's always paddling. I'm like, I'm, <laughs> I'm out of battery. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> but yeah, they're great. They're the best best money we ever spent. I tell you, same here, man. Yeah, so yeah, and then we got our daughter one because we only had two. We went to Florida, but we didn't get her one with these fat tires. We got the skinny, tall tires. I mean, she just like blows us away, though. Huh. She's gone. Wow. Like, she's just a pedal around. Yeah. <laughs> Hello there. You guys came up for this? Yeah, well, we had a travel ball game over by Avon High School. Oh, right, yeah. All right. And then my daughter lives somewhere around here, near. She just moved up there with her boyfriend. Huh. We came up here for this. Kill a couple. Yeah. Head back home. Nice. Well, have a safe trip home. You guys have a good day. Yeah, we will. So, nice talking to you. The Hilton? This concert venue. Lord of the Lost. Uh, this guy ain't going nowhere. Thanks, man. A little squeak down here. back down into the valley or the they call it the flats but yeah see that's why it's always cold down here colder so you go down and you're low level where the river runs that's a concert venue out there we like to come and sit sit on the bank here and listen Well, I think that's going to be it, guys. We did our downtown run. We're back where it's near the trail. We'll take a little bit different route for Jen. We'll go instead. We came from that way, across that bridge. Thought we would. <laughs> I'd like to ring the bell to the kids. Kids always look and they're always so excited to see our bikes. What do you think that going on down here? Probably weddings. It's becoming very trendy. Oh, is there a Indian scheme? Or Guardian scheme? Whatever, Indians. Yeah, there must be charge of barking. Good lord. Go ahead.
Yeah, the uh, Guardians made the playoffs, so everyone's jacked and excited. So maybe I'll sneak on over. And looks like the I'll sneak on down and maybe grab lunch. What the hell is going on down here? Special event parking. Oh, maybe it's these races we saw. Oh, jeez, wow. Entrepreneurs, what's going on? This is the um, head of the Cuyahoga. It's a crew, so it's like two man, four man, eight man. Oh, but races. Races. Okay, yeah, so yeah I saw them earlier, but I didn't. If I'm... you if you really want a good spot, see up on the bridge. Yes. It's spectacular. All right. All right. It's really cool. Are you from Cleveland? Yeah, I'm just amazed at all it's this. Over it's an event. It's huge. They do it every year. Really? Yeah. It's, wow. It's super cool. Yeah, no, we saw them. Well, it did look cool. So, all right. Yeah, so go up there and look, and you get both sides of the river. Yeah, we're heading back to the trail, so. It's... Huh, very That's good. Cleveland. Hey, be careful. Yeah, Have a safe day. <laughs> Pretty dog. Thank you. You know our I just look at all these boats. Wow. It's pretty crazy, isn't it? I, I can't believe how popular this event is. Uh, I didn't get the name of it. Wow, pretty cool. <laughs> you want to do lunch? We love them. Do you? Best What's money. The What's the make of these? Uh, that is a Magic Cycle, and this is a walkie. Okay. It's a much bigger bike. How fast do they go? Uh, the, they all, I don't care where you buy them from or who you buy them from, they're all going to be about 28, 30 miles an hour. Okay. Okay. So the kids all get these race bikes, but yeah. But um, you want to, I'll tell you a couple clues. I got a YouTube channel, I deal I'm a, with companies all the time. You want to step through a bike like hers. You don't want to have to throw your leg over. It gets old oh, real yeah, quick. Oh, yeah, believe me. Yeah. I, might, I fall over nowadays. And you got to be careful of the frame size. And I recommend, like, going to um, a rad dealer. There's a lot of rad dealers. And you could ride their bikes free. You could just say, can I try that? Oh, that's good to know. And go for a ride. And you get a feel for the size. Yeah. Okay. The biggest complaint I see with this 
industry, this hobby, is people buy these bikes on uh, uh, Amazon, YouTube, oh, yeah. or the internet, and they get them, and they're too big, and they can't ride them. Oh. So that's why I really, like, my wife can't this ride. pretty big. Yeah, she pretty can't, big. my wife can't ride this bike, but that bike she loves. So, you is know. Is kind of heavy? Is it heavy? They are a good size, yeah. And really, and really what you're spending the money on, you're buying the uh, battery is really. Oh, okay. Yeah, battery life. yeah, battery life. So you spend the, you know, that's probably the bulk of the cost. What's of the these. hours on it? Uh, well, it's not hours so much as it is distance, and you oh, can okay. guesstimate. Like she can get probably 50 miles. Okay. Yeah, I can. Why probably, is her? Oh no, her. Oh, that's her rim. I first thought, oh, why is her tire smooth? Okay. Yeah. There you go. Smaller tires. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's okay. Yeah. So, but it, they're the best money we ever spend. We go on trips. We just came from Virginia. We went down and we did a 60 or a 50, yeah, a 60 mile trail down there. We take the bikes and with us, we go out to the islands. We oh, take yeah. them out there. So. Nice, nice. Yeah. So, so do you wear that for to be? I do. I, I I film and then I post uh, my YouTube okay. channel and then for bike companies. Nice. Like I'm working yeah. with Walkie right now. This that's company. That's good if somebody ever ran you over or something. <laughs> yeah. That's a good thing too, to, for I know. Protection. So, yeah. So, Seriously. No, we came. Saying if somebody ever did something and hit you. you right. Yeah. So many times we see so much weird stuff and I go, darn, too bad you didn't have that camera on. I know. See. Yeah. <laughs> Just hit the button. Yeah, it's terrible. Are you girls from here? Yeah, yeah. You're from Cleveland? Yeah. Oh, yeah. How about you? Yeah, us too. We're, we live up by Parmatown. Okay. okay. So we rode our bikes down from there. So oh, if my you... daughter lives on uh, Papa Ridge. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, we can get that kind of distance. So we can come downtown, ride around all day, and get back home. and Don't have to worry about parking. And so. Are these allowed on the sidewalks? Yes, you can do them on the sidewalk. You do them on the bike trails. They're, okay. You treat them typically as a bike. They're a bike sickle, so. Safer, I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. It depends where you're at. So, Cleveland, you're you're lucky because Cleveland, you got so many great trails. You got the Emerald Necklace. That's 80 miles around the whole city. It's all trails. So you never get sick of that. And then you got the towpath will take you all the way to Cincinnati. You have your GPS on there it tells you where to turn and stuff. Right? Yeah, you're, you're just, you put your phone on it and yeah. play your music and nice. you're in good shape. So that's they're really what, nice. Sir. Yeah, they're a lot of fun. They're really yeah. great. The best, like I said, the best money we've ever spent. We get out more and do more. So it's fun. Under 2000 for these bikes? Yes. Yeah. Her bike, yeah. I would say this, this bike would be about 1800 and hers. Hers, I think they got on sale Can I 16. Take a picture of just the makes. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Help yourself. Yeah, this one's called Walkie, which. Yeah. Yeah, Magic Cycle is one of the biggest companies out there. And so they've got several bikes, but you can get a, a cheaper version of this for around 1300 okay. where it has a little bit smaller battery if you, you know, um, and it doesn't have the front suspension as it does. But And all the little light accessories, you added all that on, right? Yeah. And she, the seats, too. Yeah, she it. upgraded the seat. I like her seat. Bag. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> what makes that one? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Have fun. Yeah, girls, have fun. Have a good day. Nice talking to you. Yeah, a little bit. Guys, I'm gonna stop you here and we're gonna go eat.